Hi, hello, Blaze Rush, hello, hi, Blaze Rush, Blaze, Blaze Rush, that's what we'll be doing today. It's a racing game, you can see it in the back, there's little cars and they're going, we can do we can So yeah, hi, Blaze Rush, it's, it's the thing with the game and the stuff and the jetpacks and the weapons, vehicular combat. Um, I had a pretty rough day earlier this week, really. Ooh, it was really bad. It was really, really bad. And someone bought me this game. So thank you a million. Just just an incredible superlative amount. I have no... It's just... It's bigger than my hands can reach into the sky. That's the amount I want to thank. Storvacal on Twitter for buying me this game to make me feel better it most certainly did it is it's a really fun game there's some problems with it that's okay it's just a thought that counts but it's it helps that it's also entertaining so with that out of the way let's do some racing just career mode so cross the finish line earn a bunch of points and kill an opponent because it's vehicular combat like what what get type of game do you like shoot? What's the quintessential one? I don't know. I don't know. I can't think of one. There's some rock and roll well rock and roll off road thingy. You know the blizzard game. I can't think straight right now. There's some of that in there. So the the, the biggest problem, which is a pretty big problem, is um the control scheme is really weird in Blaze Rush. It's really strange. So I'm, I'm holding one of the analog sticks forward to move. And you gotta do that at all times. And it's really stressing on your finger. It's just, your finger's not designed to go round and round like that all the time and keep pressing forward. It takes a long time to get used to it. Boom! And I kill an opponent. Also, the camera is weird. Like it pans out to try and capture as much of the feel as possible. If you get too far behind, you'll get warped back into play. But, um, yeah, it's kind of hard to keep an overview from it, from the entire game and, like, see where you at. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, great. I just got over the finish line first! Yeah, awesome! You bet your ass it's awesome! I've unlocked locked pushback. Man, I'm crapping out on speaking today, which is cool, because that's what I'm supposed to do. I was the most dangerous, you bet your ass. Woo, win the race and acquire the most points. Finish the podium while under fire. Holy smokes, so you can also gain medals. I don't I don't think it really contributes to something. Maybe it'll do some achievement-wise and stuff. So now I'm in the second tier. Was this forestry? Use a saw as a weapon. Kill three opponents. Wow, that's that's tough. So it's different. There's 16 cars in total instead of um, the whole customization bit. It'll just give you different cars. Um, mass is how well they stay on the road. So you saw me like fly away like at the end. Acceleration naturally is how fast. Because the, the turns are rather sharp and stuff, so you need to know how well you bounce back from that. And handleability, not naturally, is how well, how smoothly, not as much as rigid like other games handle handleability. Not like you turn really slow. And this is more how smoothly you do it. So if you have low handleability, if you take a turn, it'll just drift all over the place. And it'll take a lot more time to accelerate back into a bigger position. Let's just take pushback. Let's see how he runs. We see so that little arrow I have there. That's the thing I used to drive with. Which is strange. But now that we got the basics out of the way, maybe oh, oh there we go. Collect a saw and boom. Get some weapons going. Boom. Yeah, hit him. Hit him. Ah, no, don't hit me. You gotta pick up these power-ups from the road. Also quite like, um... Uh, that Pro AM 
thing on NES, just like all other vehicle combat games. Oh, no, that was a bit sharp. I don't want to get hit by my own saw. That would be stupid. Oh, I gotta get first. There's no... Oh, no, there are. There are some... So there's two types of power-ups. There's um, these weapons, and then there's boosts. Boom, got him. Oh, no, they got me too. No, push back. You gotta push back. Push back. Oh, no. Yep, that was my own one. I am gonna land poorly. Yep, I had third place. That wasn't very good. I'm not that good at this game. Um, that's most apparent in the party mode. Of course, there's a multiplayer mode. Most agile. Yep, catch your own saw. That's not good. Let's try that one again. Um, I think this one, it's a mission that focuses on the weapon, so there's not that much of the boost, which I would still like to show off. You've seen it in the previous one, but I'd like to do that while we're actually playing it. Try and get around. Whoop! Oh! Boom! There, that dude has a boosty power-up. But of course, that's not good for me. Oh! Gotta stay ahead. Gotta smoothly drive. The problem is trying to drive as smoothly as possible. Boom. Yeah, there we go. Now I got a boost power up. And I'll go a little faster. Unfortunately, there's another one who also has it. So still getting first though. There we go. There is some rubber banding, I believe, in the game. Boom. As well. In particular, like... Like I said, if you are too far behind, the game will automatically teleport you back into the lowest setting possible. I am not doing better, it seems. Yep. Well, we're just gonna skip that one as long as we can do a whole bunch more. We'll do one more. Oh, there we go. That's the one. What's that noise? This is a death race. Avoid the roller. That's the one I'm worst with, but the one I find most enjoyable. It's like those um, small arcadey, um, small board game things. There was one with like the shark. It's probably just called Shark Attack or something in English. It's not my language. But it will go like how, how, and you have to stay ahead of the other players and stuff. It's pretty fun. Okay, so we're gonna take someone with high acceleration. Because whatever you do, you do not want to be last here. Because we're going to start off and phew, right behind us is going to be... Uh, there we go. A steamroller. The problem I have now is the, the dude I have now, he runs on air. So his handleability is really poor. He can get punched really easily. And he takes turns pretty awkwardly. Whoa. So I gotta make sure I stay first. Right now I'm doing a good job. Yeah. Yeah, eat it. There we go. Now next round. It's gonna be like in five-ish rounds, six-ish rounds. I don't know. Multiple rounds anyway. Whoa. Just gotta make sure I stay first. Oh wow! Bam. Oh, I gotta collect the power up because if you're not doing anything special here, you get lagging pretty soon. There we go. I'm lagging. I'm lagging. There we go. Whew. A little boosty, boosty power up. Boom and boop, boop, doop. That'll get me ahead, ahead of the back. Yeah, eat it. Woo! Next round. Gotta stay ahead. Gotta stay clear. I'm doing remarkably well, which is cool, because um, prior to this... Oh, wow, I am just super ahead now. That has never happened, if you're thinking this is an easy game. Never happened once before I started recording. 
but I sure seem to be super winning now. That's the kind of the problem here in the death race thing. If you're like behind, you stay behind a long time and it takes just all your skill trying to collect the power up, which is probably going to be out of your way, out of your ideal track and um, get ahead as well because you're going to lose some momentum trying to swerve out of your path to collect and then you still gotta make it back at the same time oh no oh oof. I can't fall there because there's no borders see there's some borders on some time on some areas of the level but on the others there's not and here in death race if you fall off you don't regenerate oh no well I ate it You, stay away. Yeah! Yeah, no! Oh, he just made it. I thought I was gonna... I thought I was gonna push him away. And push him dead. But he survived. Oh, for as long as he knows how to do stuff. He'll know he'll stay alive. I don't know all the lyrics. It's a pretty old song. But he survived. And he's still there. Being a pain in my ass. No! Who won? Who won? Oh, I think he won. No. No. Did I win? Did I win? I don't even know. Win the race! Yeah! Oh man, that was close. Photo finish. Whew. Then what did I do wrong? Kill three opponents. I didn't do that. That's fine by me. Okay, we'll quickly head into the party mode so I can explain the last thing. We're gonna do a quick game. It's probably not gonna um, find anyone. It's not been selling all too well, which is weird because I really like it. I think it's a game with some great potential. Um, party preferences. Gonna get up to six bots there. Oh no! Wait, wait. Party preferences. Just tack it back to one. There's not like a lot of difficulties. It starts with most difficult, but this one is already gonna kick my ass. That's the one I usually take. There we go. All game modes, and you just choose one each time. So the death race is the thing we already did. I don't think we saw King of the Hill. If so, I already forgot, so let's do that again. Um, there we go. So of course, King of the Hill, um, very known concept. You gotta stay ahead. And the guy who is first, there we go, get the little crown and we'll start accumulating points. Oh my, this is a long stretch without anything. Boom, see? So those blue things at the end means we're getting picked back up on the track. And I'm doing that a lot. Whoa! And I'm dead. Oh, I'm not picking up anything. Wow, this is a tough track. Wee and I'm dead. <laughs> so I'm not gonna win. That's uh, it's very clear. But it's a little more because of my own flaws there. I haven't done the track yet. Whoa, whoa, whoa! And I'm kind of just crapping it. It's a tough track, this one. Wee. But I seem to be not the only one. It was whoa, and I'm dead. Oh, it is just mayhem. Whoa, I'm going to die. I'm just crashing at every turn right now. Wow. Oh, I finally got ahead and well by then the dude already collect 50 points. Mmm, I did nothing. Nothing. Nothing at all. All these medals mean nothing to me. Okay, let's do another one. Let's take the standard track maybe. Hmm? See if that one fares better for us. 
again go with something with more acceleration. This guy looks neat. Boom, boom, do, do, do. I also really enjoy like um, the visuals, but and more than just like the the normal regular slick visuals. I like how like they made everything like wobbly wobbly. It gives just an added like off-roady feel to the game where you're trying to like maintain balance. Boom. Come on, I can do this. I can do this. I just gotta... Whoa, okay. There we go. There we go. Now I just gotta find a stretch. A stretch. There we go. Boom. That stretch did it. And now I am somewhat comfortably first. And now I fucked it. Damn it. No! Oh, they got me. They got me good. Now I'm just lagging again. Just whoa, whoa! Holy smokes! Just cool your jets. Get it? Cause I'm. I was being propelled by jets. So, yeah, that was the joke. That was the thing I was doing. Oh, come on, just let me pass. Oh, if I could hit this weapon, that would be... Yes! It slows you down. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, that first feeling. Ooh. Mmm. Feels so good. Oh, yeah, eat that. Ooh, no. No, 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 no. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm first. No, I'm not first. Ooh, yeah, I'm first. Ah, oh, no. There we go. Yeah. Mmm. Feels like winning. Oh, that feels so good. Ah! No! No! Stay! Shh. No! The rocket missed! What will I do now? No! It just goes over him! It doesn't have the time to land if you're that close. Oh, you dig bag! You dig bag! No! He's gonna win because I can't seem to. Uh, uh. Mm. Second guy, take him out! Don't just push him along. There we go. Thank you, thank you. Now I can win again. Oh man! Oh, this is contested. Ooh, this is tricky. Please let me win. No! 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 What did you do? What did you do? Oh, uh, oh! Uh. <laughs> I got hit by my own rocket. No! Oh, and I got the super boost, but I need to be close, pretty close. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Ah, uh, no! It's a fast guy. I can't outrun the fast guy. Why am I still? Oh! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! You gotta be kidding me! Mm. Oh, man! Just let me get close. Just let me get close. Oh, I wasn't close. Yes! Oh, yeah, come on. Come on, just a few more seconds. That's all I need, that's all I need, that's all I need, that's all I need! Mm, yes! Oh. oh, I needed that victory. <laughs> oh, man. Woo. Oh, I am sweaty. Oh, but we won. We got that on tape. I think we got an achievement, too. I was kind of celebrating there. Wow. Blaze Rush is intense. It is an intense ass game. Oh man, I do enjoy arcade racing a whole lot. Trick shots, troublemaker, overthrown, great shots, like clockwork, and Leroy 
Jenkins. There we go, we saw everything. We saw how you can suck at careers. Then we won! We actually won! Yeah! We did some races in the multiplayer mode. What I didn't explain because I was getting too much into it is you can join the multiplayer at any time. That means if I was racing there and a player would have wanted to join me, he could just do that. He didn't have to wait in a lobby, he didn't have to go spectate, he would just go poop. He would take one of the cars' place and just join up. Which is pretty revolutionary and pretty cool. Now you just gotta buy the game first. That's what you gotta do. It's pretty cool. And it doesn't it costs like nine or ten bucks on Steam. So small price, a lot of fun. I really enjoy it. You gotta handle the controls though, I gotta be honest about that. It's, it's really weird. You get used to it, we saw we saw that. But you gotta get used to it. That's that's a requirement. And I don't think it would work well, super well, on a keyboard. <laughs> Gotta be honest about that one. But man, is it fun. I am. Whew, I'm gonna need a rest. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you once more, Storvkal. Thank you so much, really. That, that, you have no idea how much that defused the entire situation. Uh, with a random act of kindness, which I... I highly recommend doing that to anyone. I've done some myself this week. And if you know me, you can always, you know, ask me stuff. Anyway, commit, subscribe. Please hit the subscribe button right now if you're gonna do that, because otherwise you'll just forget anyway. So hit the subscribe button and then you're done. You can still watch as I say other useless things, such as leave comments, leave suggestions and stuff. I've also recently got a suggestion to um, play another game, I just need to wait until it's a sale because I'm broke. That's, that's, that's the reality of it. <sighs> also like the video if you can, it would be cool. It helps me see that you enjoy things. And otherwise, just, you know, thank you very much once more, that's the final time. Never thank you! No, I will, just each time, every video. See you around. See you again some other time. Goodbye. Bye.